I'm Lynn Wilson Orr, and I had the privilege of being the principal in charge for the development of the new women's hospital in Winnipeg. This was a project that was very dear to my heart. I was born in this hospital. My grandfather was the chief plumber at the old Winnipeg General Hospital for 40 years, and my mother was a nurse in this same hospital where I was born. So for me, going back to Winnipeg and taking on the challenge, of designing a new hospital for women and newborns was really important to me. I had had experiences as a child of walking through the underground tunnels at the hospital with my grandfather, and they were very scary places. And I thought, you know, this is not the way we want newborns to experience the beginning of their lives. We want them to be able to stay with their parents, to be cared for in a nursery that was just down the hall if they were really sick preemies or you know sick newborns who needed extra care. So it was important to us as a firm because we are very specialized in healthcare and very passionate about creating environments for people because we believe that the environment that you get care within can make a difference to how you experience that care. Uh, based on evidence-based design, we know that people get better faster, they need less pain medication, and they feel better about their care if they're cared for in a well-designed environment. And the hospital administration at the time really wanted a facility that would bring women's health care in Manitoba into a new kind of care paradigm. They had done a lot of work before they hired the architects to talk to women in Manitoba, to ask what they wanted in a hospital, to understand what was important to them about care. And then we were very fortunate that the hospital agreed to an IDP process, so an integrated design process. And that gave us a wonderful opportunity to work with the caregivers, the neighborhoods, uh, associations, the people that lived around the hospital, uh, hospital administration, hospital staff, were all brought together through the IDP process to develop a design charter for the new hospital.